Look at that black girl, look at that black girl, look at that black girl. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Shay Love, you can call me Shay and today I have a very special video for you guys. Once again, before we get started with this video, make sure you go ahead and like this video because I know you're going to like this video. And let's get right into it. In today's video, I'm showing you guys my updated nighttime skincare routine for my acne prone skin. So I'm going to start by washing my hands and then wetting my face with some warm water. And then I'm going to cleanse with the Dr. Bronner's Pure Castile Soap. I have it in peppermint and it's actually a very strong cleanser so you might want to dilute it or use the unscented baby version when you're first starting out because it is really really strong it has no um synthetic surfactants that can irritate your skin it doesn't have any additives or fillers or anything like that so it is a very natural cleanser it's also great for removing makeup Okay, so next I'm going to tone with some witch hazel. Witch hazel is known to remove any extra dirt or makeup that your cleanser may have missed. So I definitely like to use a cotton pad or cotton ball in this case to go over um, all of my face, especially in like the crevices around my nose and stuff that I may have missed with um, my cleanser to get all that makeup out. It's also known to absorb oil, reduce inflammation, and tighten your pores. Next, I'm going to take some oil. I like to use rosehip oil on my face at night. It is known to even your skin tone and it helps to fade and get rid of dark marks, which is something I really, really need. So I like to use that because I have a lot of acne scars on my face. And then it's also known to help firm your skin. So I use that all over my face pretty liberally and I like to rub it in really well to make sure my face is nice and moisturized. I'm taking some shea butter to moisturize my skin. As I said in the beginning of the video, my skin is pretty dry. So, so putting this on at night, it may seem kind of greasy, but by the time the morning comes, my skin feels very moisturized. So this is known to also treat acne and blemishes as well as restore elasticity in your skin. So I'm very generous with this all over my face, rubbing it in so it's distributed evenly. Lastly, I'm going to take my good old tea tree oil, which I also used in my last skincare video. And I use this the same way as like an on-the-spot acne treatment on any blemishes that I feel like might come up or like I want to dry out anything. And yeah, that's about it. That's going to conclude my nighttime skincare routine. I try to keep it simple. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you go ahead and leave me a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video.